Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on the Alpha Meteorologist. I'm so, I have not uploaded in a little bit, but I um, was waiting for this day. Tropical storm, or hurricane more of it, Isaias, is about to make landfall. Possibly next 15 to 30 minutes, we are expected to have a landfall. Places like Sunset Beach, almost in the eye already. Possibly, it's, it is, seems to be coming ashore at the moment, Oak Island now in the eye wall of it. Uh, you can see the rain, even if we go to this way, it's rain stretching into Washington, D.C. from this storm. Um, but we do have a tornado warning. Torn uh, it, it seems to actually have expired at the moment. There was a tornado on the ground. It was a confirmed tornado just actually northwest of Wilmington, actually. So that was on the ground, but it seems to have lifted. Uh, you can see it is coming ashore. The center is somewhere right about inside there. But you can see if we go back to an hour, let's delete this. You can see that this eyewall band was sort of right about there. And it was really not that strong. But now it has completely moved to here. And it is pretty strong now. It's heavy rains, strong winds. Uh, it is currently an 85 mile an hour category 1. We don't expect much more intensification. It can. It can happen. And it may happen in the next advisory, which is in a, probably about 30 minutes. But we may be a Category 1 or 2. Uh, lots of the hurricane is on land. Though. Lots of the bands are in land and the eye is seeming to move on. So that it could still intensify, but less chance of it intensifying as lots of it is on land. But still a chance of it just because the southern side is still ashore, could intensify. Um, Wilmington, it seems that it may make landfall just south w southwest of there. Actually, Sunset Beach is almost, it shows that they are in the eye. I don't know if that is true, but I do think that Sunset Beach is in the eye. Um, but you can see that it is really a uh, really strong hurricane. Um, I know this is about the hurricane, uh, hurricane Isaias, but I'm going to quickly touch up on this severe thunderstorm warning in New York, um, Connecticut. You can see, uh, um, 0.75 inch hail and 60 miles an hour winds, but, uh, um, it is not that much. It, it's a pretty strong line, actually. It's gone through New York and it is moving to Bridgeport, Connecticut, New Haven, Connecticut. You may get some of the... Strong report, but the strong report seems to be going west of you. Hartford, if it can make it to, and it may even make it into some parts of western Massachusetts. Um, there was, actually yesterday, sort of a severe weather outbreak. Not really an outbreak, but uh, what I call a very mini tornado outbreak. Not a, it's a very mini one. It's like two, torn two three tornadoes. We had a tornado actually touched down places like... Um, we had a tornado, they had a tornado, um, confirmed in Northwestern Connecticut, then in Massachusetts, um, Blandford, Huntington, and it almost made its way to Amherst, which is a big city, but it disintegrated, disintegrated. You can see, though, this is a strong, very strong hurricane. Um, uh, is this a different, this maybe this is a different weather station. There we go. But North Myrtle Beach, North Myrtle Beach is in the eye. It's sort of in the eye wall right now. Could be in the eye any second. But Sunset Beach is in the eye of this storm, I do believe. Uh, but uh, let's look at the National Hurricane Center. The cone, you can see it is a hurricane expected to become a tropical storm after it hits land. But expected to go a long way. Long, long way. Tropical storm warnings now for southern coast of Maine, tropical storm watch for northern coast of Maine, but all the way down to some of North Carolina tropical storm warnings. The most like likely tropical storm force winds, places like Massachusetts, Tuesday 6 p.m., Tuesday 8 p.m., places like New Hampshire, Vermont, um, Tuesday 2 p.m., New northern New Jersey, New York City. But uh, you can see that there is a 80% chance of tropical storm force winds in central Massachusetts, 70% chance of Boston, 90% chance in Atlantic City, 100% chance in all of eastern North Carolina. But then that chance starts to fade out as we get into Canada. Um, spaghetti models do show... Oops. 
there. Do show it going like almost right over Albany. Um, Pittsfield, Massachusetts, and Albany, New York actually seems to be going right over Albany. Maybe even a little west, but flash flood risk right here. You can see Albany all basically all into southern Vermont, all the way down into some of the South Carolina. 20% chance of flash flooding. But as we go east into places Boston, 5%. And places of Worcester, Massachusetts, and um, more west and east, that one area is going to be the highest chance of flash flooding. Rain forecasts up to 6 inches, 6 to 10 inches in places near... Um, Northern Virginia, Southern Maryland, but um, as we get into places like Boston, less than an inch of rainfall expected. Satellite, you can definitely see that eye right there. Uh, where is it? Right there, you can definitely see that. Um, let's go here. Let's look at the latest image of this thing. You can see the, here it is. Um, the eye, I believe, it's somewhere somewhere in there, somewhere in there, almost, I believe. But, um, look at the animated loop of this thing. Uh, you can see that there is some rotation, definite rotation. And, uh, rotation actually seems to be slowly coming back, slowing down. But you can see that it is coming ashore very shortly. Um, yeah, but before we end the video, um... I'm gonna show you this image that I have, a chart that I really made actually. Um, uh, based on impacts, I've, I've put North Carolina and South Carolina under a high risk, high risk. Um, places, lots of places under a moderate risk: Virginia, D.C., Maryland, Delaware. Eastern, Eastern Pennsylvania is really under that moderate risk. Western Pennsylvania under a slight, even a little, when you go all the way west, little impact. Central, slight. But I put Pennsylvania under a slight impact because I can't, or moderate impact because I can't split up the state. If we go north New York, which is mostly, like I said, like the places near Long Island, New York City, Albany, what? Um, but then Vermont, New Hampshire, Massachusetts, Connecticut, Rhode Island, and Maine's under a slight risk. Um, it is definitely coming ashore now. Um, could make landfall very soon, but I do think that is going to be it for this video. Um, I can show you guys the latest radar real quick. Let me delete all these drawings to make it not look crammed. You can definitely see Sunset Peach. Even Carolina Shores, Sunset Beach is in the eye right now. Is in the eye, at least it shows. I'm not an idiot. This is the eye right here. I'm in it, but uh, before let's look at velocity. You can definitely see lots of it. That is, um, based on this though. Let's go to reflectivity. You can see that this is the eye right here. Um. You can definitely see the rotation of it. I'm um, really trying to actually form an eye wall, trying to connect. That's why it may intensify, but um, Sunset Beach is in the eye. You can definitely see that. But yeah, guys, so I think that is going to be it. If you guys are in the path of this, please prepare, stay safe, and I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye, stay safe.